Welcome to Christmas Eve Live, December 24th, 2023, 12.46 p.m. Eastern Time Zone. This live stream, we're going to help some people that may be having some financial difficulties by offering fragrances for a dollar for a few lucky people. And we do have a code for 10% off right here if you're shopping online. All the links would be provided in the description. Before we wait for people to come on so I can connect with you, I'll tell you what I will wear for Christmas. And it's going to be Maison Alhambra Tabac, which is a clone of Dior Tabac color. I've made so many times the mistake when I'm trying to put this on to wear. And I grabbed this by accident because it looks identical to it. And the smells identical. It's like the 99% accurate clone to this and i actually love this smell this one has a little bit more masculinity a little bit more emphasis of course 340 dollars versus 35 36 dollars that's what i'll be wearing it's nice it's boozy it's got this warm spicy white floral note with some tobacco honey fruit and it trans transports you to like this cool place in your head it's very sophisticated and masculine all at the same time. La Tafa Maison Alhambra Tabac smells like Dior Tabac color. The next fragrance I'll talk about while we wait for people to come on. I see a few people already came on here. Jeff, NH Rebels, Merry Christmas. Rali Ali, Love from India. Rob King, Drayson, Kevin Long. Hello, everybody. I'm going to connect with all of you. I just want to tell you some of my favorite fragrances, and then I'm going to talk to each and every one of you. We're just going to chill out for a little while. The next fragrance I was going to talk about, we're going to give away, is this. <clears throat> Ombre Oud Baldessarini. It's by Hugo Boss. It's a fragrance that reminds me of Leather Oud by Christian Dior. Same high-end like this Dior one. And the fragrance has notes of whiskey, apple, and oud. The box is right here, the bottle. If you want this and you're in need, don't take from people. Only if you need to take, you can order this for $1 right now. It's your first gift of the day. I will mention some other gifts soon. So there's only one of these, so one lucky person will pay a dollar for this, plus the shipping. It's like $9.95. It's $40 on eBay. All right. That's life. Be sure to drop a Christmas like F. Tori. Mr. Tori, I'd like to give you something. If I have your address, you know, you can email me and I'll put together a package for you and your wife. You've been very generous. There's been a lot of generous people throughout the year. Captain Nemo has must, <clears throat> must have donated 25 fragrances to give away here. So there is that. And the next fragrance that I've been digging is called... Masa, Bamasa is a Gynamide fragrance. I just ordered the Gynamide from Neiman Marcus. Dented another credit card for $200 or so. Maybe I got a discount because I gave him my email address. So this has violet, saffron, lemon, pink pepper, solid bottle, two pound bottle, patchouli amber. So it's like a light, non-offensive fragrance, but it does last long. It's by La Tafa Pride. It's their higher end stuff. And it smells very good, new, unique, suede, patchouli, amber, mineral notes, like nothing you've smelled before. It's like $44. The next fragrance that I got a sample of was called Louis Vuitton Fleur de Dessert by Jack Cavalier. One day I'm going to dive deep into these perfumers because they're making perfumes for Louis Vuitton. They've also made fragrances for inexpensive companies too, like well, not inexpensive, but like Hugo Boss or Ferragamo or things like that. So, Fleur de Dessert is orange blossom and oud mixed together with honey and rose, but it smells very masculine. And the next one by Louis Vuitton. So, I don't have a clone for Fleur de Dessert. If you do know one, comment down below. The next one is called Metro Noir. It's another Jacques Cavalier fragrance. So, there you go. Syrupy, black, currant, and watery notes mixed with cyclamen and deep sambuc jasmine and it does have some dark notes what are the dark notes incense benzoin resin and oud this thing is phenomenal it's phenomenal and there is a clone out this is called metro noir the clone is called essence noir 
by Fragrance World. I don't have it here today. We're just, like I said, we're going to chill out and talk. So the fragrance is just um, gives you this olfactory work of art. Now we're going to talk to a few people and I'll reveal the third fragrance that I'm going to give away. Karan Bao wearing Nasomato. Okay, there we go. There's your comment. We got Jason Jones Green, Kevin Long, Rob King. What's up, Rob? How you doing today? Let's start down the line. Let's start from the top. We got Kevin. He's always the first one on Lakeland, Florida. We said hi to you, NH Rebel. We said hello, Jeff. Hello from Wisconsin. JT, what's up, Unc? South Kalaki, Santaro, Santana Rodriguez. Do you like Santana? His scent of the day is Amir Ala Oud. Intense, Kevin Long says hello. I think you're from L.A., aren't you, Kevin? Rob, where are you from? I forgot, but you do work out, don't you? It looks like you do. <laughs> Drayson Jones Green, where are you from? I thought you were from, you're not from Sweden, are you? No, you're from Baltimore. Voy catch B Montal Intense Pepper Clone. Somebody can uh, comment to Voy. I don't know how to pronounce your name. Voisiech. Voisiech. Is that correct, B? Karan Bell is wearing Nasamato Black Afghano tonight. Mmm. That's a very nice fragrance. Nasomato. I love that company. And we have G Man. Single dad with two kids living in Fort Lauderdale with now assistance from anybody. I can use the help. Well, G Man. Get you one of those. If you're the first one to order it, you can get this for a dollar. So there you go. It's only one left. So get it. That's life. Be sure to drop. We already say hey, that's life. How are you doing? And we have Charlton Kilpatrick who says happy holidays. We have Incubus. Have you ever heard the song Incubus? No, you're from Nigeria. That's very nice of you, Incubus. AC Perkins. I won giveaway two months ago. Never received anything. Mm-hmm. Um, well, I don't know about that, but I don't know what you want. I never remembered your name. 76 Garado clone for Gucci 2 per ohm. Yeah, that is a Bentley fragrance that does the clone for that. Just don't have it on the top of my head. This guy says, Happy Holidays from New York City. He loves Soaked Sun. That is a Louis Vuitton clone. It's very, very good. Cleveland! Ohio. What's up, Jason? Okay, and then Kevin Long. Nope, he's from Michigan. Okay, Kevin Long's from Lapeer, Michigan. And this guy, he's from San Jose, California. San Jose. San Jose. Where is that near? Is near LA? San Jose. And then, thinking about ordering Armat Ventana Marina, you lift it on your best brand's website. Really appreciate your hard work. Listen, F. Tori, you just... Did you just have a, a young boy? If you order it, just remind me. I'll, I'll give you a gift. You've been supporting me for a long time. Rob King, that's right. You're from Kansas. I remember. Now we got sent to the day. La Nuit de Loma, a few sprays, quick trigger to gas station for eggnog. Yeah, I got you, Kevin. Eggnog, huh? Now, do you ever wear La Nuit de Loma, the parfum or the extreme edition? No? What's everyone going to get into today? Okay, so you're from Michigan. Kevin Long? From Michigan, yep. Yeah. And then oh, this guy is from Karan Bao, near San Francisco. Cool in the Gang Jungle Boogie. That's a good song, A.C. Perkins. I see you're all dressed in blue with a Range Rover behind you. Oh, and you got your uh, west side, is that? Better not flash any gang signals. Next fragrance, I gotta show you this. This killer. This is called Cedrat Boise Intense. One million percent. I might have talked about this yesterday. I found a clone to this. One million percent, right? It's 35 bucks. It's right here. This is 99% this. 99% this fragrance right here. Instinct Noir by La Tafa is the clone for this. It is incredible. It is long lasting. It's spot on in three, 38 seconds. It smells identical. Now this one, 
might have a touch little more some kind of some kind of touch of floral but it other than that it dries down identical it's got that intense mean green pineapple leathery note that's what the main focus is pineapple leather in both of these so if you ever want to smell like this intense cedar boise this is like 180 this is 35 get it so there it is we have um montal intense pepper clone there are some but i forgot i had a video i made about it brother john how are you doing did you have scent of the day hamra mixed with armaf untold interesting may get ldnl edp and we have chase manhattan from new york new jersey chase manhattan john clem how much is the top affection where can i get it affection Oh, yeah, I think it's on the website called Best Brands Perfume. It's one of my favorite fragrances. We have like one or two left. It should be there, and if it isn't, it's right here, and I can add it. Just let me know. Go, I'll check for you real quick. I'll check and see if it's there. Affection, A-F-F-E-C-T-I-O-N. Yeah, it's it's got one left in stock. Clem said the website's 39 the books. Incredible fragrance. You know why? Because men or women can wear it. Now here, if anybody else needs help, I'm going to put John Clem here. If I saw Gang Man, he wanted some help for so he got the Baldessarini. I'm not sure if he got it. But I'm going to show you something else. Here's brother John. He knows DMV smell good crew. We got this guy we already talked to. And then we have Shiltaraj Power. Thank you for suggesting Reef Elegant Ohm. You're welcome. Cool picture you got there. Got compliments the first day. All right. Raid Saeed from Ireland. Wow. Are you from Ireland? And Heads Benkowitz. Hope you're doing good. Heads, I like your new logo. It looks cool. We'll leave it up there for you for a moment. If anybody wants this fragrance, anybody at all, is Ferragamo Yomo Signature. I put it on the website. There's three left. Brand new. One ounce bottles for a dollar. Merry Christmas. And you could just please only order one. Be nice. Don't order all three of them. You can just order one for a dollar or add it to your order if you're ordering something. And that's the giveaways today. We're giving away this for a dollar and this brand name designer fragrances. Merry Christmas. There's one of these and three of these. So four lucky people will get that. My favorite fragrances. Carlos, how are you doing? Yes, I know you're looking for that um, classic Cayenne. It's coming in January. I know. I see your emails. Don't worry. I see everything. Happy holidays from Wisconsin. From Wow. That's a cool logo. <laughs> That's a really cool logo. Look at that logo, guys. Louis Vuitton. <clears throat> Merry Christmas to everyone. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Brother John says that. Dr. Sense. Dr. Sense. He's got an awesome, awesome TikTok channel. He plays cool retro music with fe featuring bottles. His name's Duran. If you ever see him, go check out his TikTok channel. I think it's called Dr. Sense. And he's got this cool song. I don't know if you made that song, but it's a real catchy tune. It's in my head. It's like very catchy. You know, Dr. Sense and I have some of the same similar tastes in music. Nathan Petty Jr., good morning from California. What's the best Dior Sauvage Eau de Toilette clone? I would like to say this one is called Oramath Urban elixir it's, it's a black bottle not urban man it's a brown bottle urban man elixir okay nathan petty jr you like to race cars what part of california are you from john kim how much would it be together with taxes shipping well that i don't know um but you can add on a free gift or just type in free and you'll get free gift plus i'll add you a free gift if you don't add the free gift I've got tons of bottles that I'm giving away free randomly. So I'll give you a free bottle. 
for men. I don't really have any more left for women, but if I do, I'll give you that. I have tons of free samples. I want to show you this. This is a brand new female fragrance called Mag Magnifique. And I do have a lot of samples of this fragrance, like little sprayers that look like this. And this fragrance smells like Coco Mademoiselle. I don't have the bottle here either. But the bottle smells awesome. The bottle is really cool looking. And there's a whole line of these for women. They're called Mrs. R. Map. Most of them are triggering to classic expensive fragrances like Chanel. Like this one's Coco Mademoiselle. They got one for Chanel Chance. They got one for Narciso Rodriguez. Christian Dior Jador. This is the one that I've researched and tested. And also this is one left on the website. But anyway, John Clem, for your question... I'll send you all five these samplers for the women if you want that. And this is another good one for women. It's called Monarch Kayali. I call it Celebrity Fenty because Rihanna's bottle is identical and identical in smell. So there's that, John. No, sir. Yep, you wrote it, huh, Dr. Sense? Cool. Which is the best baby cat clone? It is Nile Queen. Reef Cat doesn't even compare to it. No offense, but it's like kitty toys compared to that. Nile Queen, it's so good. I always keep it right by me. It smells so good. Look at this thing. It's so strong. It's amazing. Baby cat. This one I've had for like since June. And it smells even better. But you're talking about caramel and benzoin resins and vanilla. And nice mixture of sweet and dark. I love that. I love that. So that's your answer. Dr. Sense wrote that song. Kind of reminds me of that. The beginning has a kind of same song as that one chicken song. What's it called? Oh, never mind. Are you shipping to Europe? No, not yet. We know not. We're just a little small company, you know. Thank you, sir. Bakersfield, about 100 miles of Los Angeles. That's really cool, Nathan Petty Jr. What do you think, Alhambra, Valencia Rouge, and Glacier La Noir? Is Valencia Rouge a Baccarat Rouge? Don't doubt kills more dreams than failure ever will. Hey, I like that saying, my friend. So Glacier La Noir, I have not tried. Is that Fragrance World correct? And Alhambra for Sencia Rouge, I've not tried. Alhambras are so hard to get for some reason. Like the good ones, I got Victory, Victory Elixir, and and I've got the Tabac. Tabac is by Alhambra, the clone of this. <laughs> Oh, here it is. Yeah, this is an Alhambra fragrance. Yeah, I think this is Alhambra. Yeah, Alhambra. Okay, but well, that one I've never smelled yet. Let's see what we see. Zerjoff Tommy Lomi clone. I never even heard of that. Kadim Charles Zerjoff Tommy Lomi clone. Douglas Banks, do you know of a Beau de Jour clone? Yeah, that's real easy. It's called Zeno Davidoff. Just get that, it's $20. It smells very, very close to it. Zeno Davidoff. A little bit more, more strong, but Beau de Jour, the new one by Tom Ford, you're speaking of, I'd imagine. Dr. Sense, I have to try that baby cat clone. Yes, you do, Dr. That Nile Queen is straight fire, I see. He knows. What does affection smell like? It smells like whipped cream, ice cream, fruits, all mixed together. Let me tell you. It's a fragrance that is described as yummy, creamy, strong projection. And here are the notes. 
pistachio whipped cream hazelnut rum right there it sounds delicious doesn't it then you have pistachio ice cream bergamot cardamom it's like doubled in and then the base notes whip it up with whipped cream marshmallow cotton candy tonka sandalwood cedar so it's got all these beautiful notes that you think is going to be a female you know girly fragrance but then it's got all those dark notes too but it's not dark it's like a refreshing dessert style fragrance it's very very right in the middle anybody can wear it very strong projection like really really strong projection for two hours everywhere i go is sold out it's hard to find and i do have the one left and now you're making me want to spray it because i love it so much i have to spray it now because i admit i whoops sorry about that this is what it looks like and this is all green you can't see it because there's a green screen and you spray it and instantly smell the citruses you can smell the pistachio ice cream and then later on you'll get that whipped cream feeling with the cedar woods and i'm telling you it is projecting like crazy right now this is phenomenal you know it's a clone of kayali yum pistachio I'm not very familiar with the Kayali brand, but it's 168 at Sephora. And I was trying to figure out how to get it for 30% off, but they don't have it. So there's your answer to that. John Clem asked me, what does affection like? Then we have Someday Santal 33 clone. Mm. There's a new company out there that makes a clone of it. Yeah, I forgot the name though. Sorry. It's. It's a new Sterling fragrance. Merry Christmas from Amp Dad 87. Look at that. He's got all his kids. He's proud of the kids. Kinan Salim. Is Eros Flame clone? Oh. Oh, yeah. Kinan. I found an Eros Flame clone, but it's a secret. Literally, it's called Secret. I'm going to release it later when everything calms down. That's very, very good and very, very affordable. And that makes sense because it's a subsidiary. I've been finding this these houses that are, you got Alhambra, subsidiary of La Tapa, and you got a whole bunch of other ones that are connected to them. And I found one right here is a perfect example. You don't know this company. It just says, it's like blank. It says Asal. I call it Whiskey Ghost. It's the exact clone of Hamra. It's an exact, almost exact clone of this fragrance called Angel Share by Killian. And you pull this thing off like this, and then it, the box opens up kind of strange. Like that. And then there's really no markings, no name on it, but here it says Asal. It says Asal, but the thing lasts 14 hours. It's like a serious, cost $25, lasts 14 hours, not even kidding. Smells just like Harma, very sweet, tobacco, honey, just like Angel Share, some some dips of cognac in there as well. So if you wanted a hidden gem cheaper than Hamra, there you go. Type in Whiskey Ghost or Asal. You'll find them in India, but not in the U.S., I can guarantee you that. How do I know? Because I've been looking all over for it. Glacier Bold is good. What's Glacier Bold? Doctor, you know lots of those new ones I see on your your TikTok show. I don't you don't know how you find them. Shine, do you know about fragrance Pacha Ibiza? No. What is that, Shine? Tell me. Tell me, Shine. That we got today. Santana Rodriguez. That's the Eros Flome average performance. So we're going to find out. Because it's the same company as that one I just showed you. I think this new one I found is going to be a $25 Beast Mode Eros Flame clone. Tom Rogers. Merry Christmas. Thanks for the discount. Look at that smile. Nice, clean, white teeth. Wayne, uh, Merry Christmas. Hope you all have a great day. You too, Wayne, man. Pun, pun. What do you think about YSOYDP? It's my favorite. You mean... I love it. I love YSLYEDP. And the new one I love is called YSLYEDP. Intense. Really like that one. How do you feel about La Tapa Affection? 
Well, we just went over that. It's yummy pistachio whipped cream, ice cream, and I love it. And I would recommend you get it if you can find it. And live 10 discount is 10% off. It should be off your entire cart, by the way. Live 10 discount should be off the entire cart, but it might be for $60 off. And if that doesn't work, John, you can use Unc 10. That'll get you another four dollars unk 10 for sure gets you the the 10 percent gets you four dollars off that latafa affection that there's one left hey unk jaquil white wants to know is there a clone of apple brandy i've never even tried that is it any good apple brandy on the rocks it sounds like apple and brandy have you ever tried it jaquil and i'll find a clone for you soon what do you think of about real oud? You've tried, you tried rucus. It's made from real vetiver. Smells like when it rains on soil. I have not tried this. Where do you learn this from, Pun Pun? Look at your cool icon you got. That's very interesting. Did you draw that? JPG La Mail clone La Glacier. La Glacier is a JPG La Mail La Parfum clone, doctor? Kinan Salim, what is your favorite La Tafa Pride perfume ever? This has got to be it right here. Vintage radio. It's very, very wearable. No headache. Anybody can wear it. It's clean and refreshing and unique. All at the same time, it's the clone of Vinicio's Paragon. This thing is on fire. You know what? They got a whole bunch of brand new Blaptafa Prides. So people are a little bit upset thinking they're like, too high they're about 40 dollar average price everywhere 40 some people sell it for 60 50 amazon sells it for 50 or 60 but ebay sells it 42.95 i probably have them for 39 plus 10 percent off <laughs> and we have the next question sir what time are the most what time at this time what is the most close creed event is dupe that would have to be our math club de nuit intense, but get the parfum edition or eau de parfum. But the, there is one called pure parfum. That's the closest. And if you have extra, find the one called, see pure parfum comes in five ounce bottle. That's 150 milliliter. Eau de parfum comes in 200 milliliter bottle. And then the eau, pure parfum limited edition only comes in 100 milliliter bottles so you weigh out all the things the best one is the limited edition second best one is parfum third one is eau de parfum and those are the best right now that i could find for the best now there are lots of clones of aventus you know tons and tons that are 20 15 20 dollars you know so that's your answer for that i have tried why so? But I have heard it is no green apple note that I love. Mm hmm. I see. There's something about it that I love. I like things that are intense. They also had one Y S O Y, eau de toilette live intense. Pacha has to be the sexiest clone I have ever smelled. Shine says it's smoky, herbal, then dark fruits and base notes are sweet and champagne like. What is pacha? What is that? Who makes it? What is it, a clone of something? Does Vintage Radio last long and project well? Yes. To me, it lasted eight hours. It's very well built and projects very, very strong. But Affection projects stronger. No, Vintage Radio projects longer and stronger than... No, Affection. Okay, look. It's easier when I hold them in my hand. One day I tested this vintage radio with this affection, and the vintage radio outlasted the affection. The affection was projecting longer than the vintage radio, so that's the answer to that. Both of them last incredibly long, project well, very, very good projection, and both of them, one of them lasts a little bit longer, and it was this one. This is more youthful, this is more... Just an everyday, clean, unique scent, and it's it's just something that smells so good. If you've ever smelled Paragon, it's so comfortable to wear, you know? You can just wear it 
dressed up, dressed down, one for all, all for one. Oh, there's a brand new Ombre Nomad clone. It's by La Tapa. It's called Voyage Exclusive. It's $40. Looks just like it. And I think I know why they're doing this because they make the bottle like that. And their company, Alhambra, might have gotten in trouble because this can looks like this. But we really shouldn't be teaching people this information. But that's the truth. Full transparency. It's just my opinion, though, really. It's, it's my um, opinion. It's my suspicion. That's all. I meant Sephora. Oh. Felix Hernandez. Merry Christmas. Did you already talk about divine perversion? What is that? Matt Haycraft, how you doing? Hope you have a great new year. You too, Matt. And Jason Sellers. Best nomad clone on the site. So many of them. The best nomad clone, Jason, will have to be... There's one called Leather Gold by RMF. Smells the closest to it. The second one is called Flavia Ombre noma ombre nouveau flavia ombre nouveau is the second best clone and the third one now these are based on performance and accuracy of scent and the third one is this new one which would be the best clone for your money for 40 dollars is called voyage now the leather gold lasts longer the Flavia Ombre Nomad lasts extremely long, and this one lasts about an hour less, two hours less. But if you're talking about 10 versus 8 hours, $40 versus 60 something like that price range. So I would get this if you're on a budget, but if you want the best, I mean, the, the Ombre Nomad's $350, but maybe even more with tax. So get the leather gold one if you wanted the best one. Hope that answers your question. Some other great clones that were popping are called uh, Cobalt Blue by Carolina Herrera. This is hard to find as it is, and the clone is very hard to find. It's one of my favorites. It's called Pacific Woods. Now, as we talked about, I'm sure they're gone now, but if they're not, you get one of these. If you need it, they're only a dollar. Merry Christmas to you. And if you're ordering something, there's lots of threshold gifts. This is a dollar as well. This is really cool. And then there's lots of free gifts if you order 40 or 60 or $100 with the stuff. So you can go look at that. There's a discount code, 10% off right here. If you're watching the restream, trying to give to everyone, get everyone a chance. Also, this is the best Marc Jacobs perfect clone. It's called Pink. Everyone's been buying it. it. Smells so good. This is my favorite designer fragrance of the year. Aqua de Gio Parfum. This is my second favorite. Is the YSLY Eau de Parfum Intense. And this one is for like just a dumb grab. It's like cheap. Well, not cheap. It's like $80. It's called Myself by YSL. It's really nice and comfortable to wear. You just smell good, you know? You can just spray. Oh, yeah. It smells really good. So I like this. These kind of fragrances mass appeal to wear anytime, any day. But like when you go to fancy events, I don't know. People want to wear Christmas fragrances that are strong and spicy and oody because of the season. It makes you feel like. Viking, like Creed Viking, smells like Christmas. Um, Lily of the Valley. Let's see. Jasmine Peony. Yeah, you can find some Lily of the Valley, raspberry and white peach. You're correct, sir. You are correct. Yes, Alhambra got in trouble for their Mimo Paris clones and had to discontinue. Discontinue. I got Russian and African leather clones before they did. 
I'm still looking for Roman leather. Hmm. Where are you? Where did you say you are? You're in the California area? How many days do I have to wait? Okay, um, probably, well, did you know that the post office is closed on Sundays and on Christmas? So there's two days right there. And then Tuesday is the 26th. So I don't know where you live, but you'll have to wait for it to start moving till then. I'll make sure it goes out on the 26th, sir, okay? And I'll see what all the stuff I can throw in your box. And I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. Hey, look at that. Frank Page is here. Nazir Patel is here. Best clone for Ombre Nomad. For the money, just get the get the one called Voyage Exclusive. Is the big bottle myself available? Um I'll check later, okay? I'll see. You. I'll just check back when the live stream ends. I'll check it for you. Hey, sincerity, this is not a spicy cologne. This is a fragrance that smells sweet, boozy chocolate whiskey. Sincerity, it's a Javinci Gentleman Reserve clone. Actually, I have to shout out Neeb. He's the one who put me onto this one, and he was dead on on that. It's a fantastic fragrance. Lasts a long time. And this is the same company. This is a blue freshy fragrance, you know. This is called Pacific Woods. It's the same company that does this. It's so hard to find. And this is the clone, baby. This is mass appealing. Compliment cooler, right? So there's that. Those are some of my favorite clones of the year alongside the new Bond number no. 9 clones <clears throat> and this clone here called Instinct Noir that clones this. This is cloning this. Love it. Love the new Bond number no. 9 Greenwich Village clone. It's called Avenue London. Okay. I love this clone too. This is just as strong, if not stronger, than Jerome Sport. And smells just like it. It's Fragrance World. You can't see it because it's clear. Fragrance World Parfum de Ohm smells just like Dior Ohm Sport. This is $25 or $35 and lasts seven, eight hours. I don't know how they do it, I'll tell you. And then the new RMAF Club de Nuit Oud is phenomenal too, if you like that kind of fragrance by Zhirzhov Herba Pura. So that's your answer. Your choice. Go Spectre or Vintage Radio. 100. 100%. I will wear Vintage Radio over Go Spectre. But, yep, I wear the Vintage Radio. I, I wear Paragon more than I wear Ani. It's like you have to commit to wear Ani. Okay, you have to commit to wear it. So there's that. Someone just called me. I'm sorry. My my brain is, went to the call, but I didn't take it. Nazir, best clone of Omni Nomad. We answered you. Hello, I'm wearing Interlude. Man, that's fantastic. Sam, six gears in action. Look at a cool thumbnail you've got. Raphael says hi. I said hi back. Run, run. Please try real oud. It's natural. It has a lot of health benefits. Real rucus and real deer musk. You can find them easily in Saudi. Okay, sir. I know what real oud is. It comes from trees from Southeast Asia. When they're sick, they produce a resin. The resin, they pull it out. Some ouds are very, very expensive because some trees only make a little bit. There's different types of ouds that they can find. That's real oud. Some oud is nasty, like fecal oud, and, and that's the kind I don't like. But I can tell the difference between high-quality oud and and fecal oud, but some people, you're right, they do like the strong, strong fecal oud because after 10, 20 hours, it turns into a beautiful smell. First, it's fecal and it gets to where it wants to be. Some fragrance people use them in their fragrances and you have to wait for it to develop. So it's not good for sales in that sense because when stores spray, they'll go, oh, no. Oh, wow. That's this on my hand. <laughs> Smells good. 
Okay, sincerity is awesome. I bought it from you. Good job, King Davis Jr. Pickpocket 72 is a Duskwood collection better than Aquid. Anakid? I've never heard of Anakid. What is Anakid? Help me out, Pickpocket 72. I like your logo. It reminds me. No crime. Is that what it means? No criminal? I'm in Stockton, my brother. I just ordered it for me. Stockton, California? Okay. Well, you're going to get it probably... I'm going to be frank with you. Those UPS, USPS workers kind of get chilled and laid back after this hard month they've had. You've got to respect them. They've had more than 4 billion packages in 30 days in just the U.S. of A. So, I mean, I'm not their worker, but some of them like to work and work extra time and make that money. But if I send it on Tuesday, buddy, you'll probably get it the following Monday. You'll be lucky if you get it Friday. But I wouldn't count on it because then you got the whole thing with the New Year's and New Year's Day. So, but I'll ship it out first thing. You just got bumped up. Charlie Brook, happy holidays from Texas. What part of Texas are you from? Well, we can't find it right now. I try to get it every single week. Every week, my friend. Oh, it is? Okay, well, there you go, Carlos. You can get that 10% off, which is a big discount on that thing. I think it's like 90 or 100 so you'll get $10 off. I think I'll order Nile Queen and Vintage Radio from you. Thank you, Wally Champ 15 I appreciate that. I think I'll give you some free gifts, but I don't know if your name will be Wally Champ 15 Yes, Cambodia Oud kind of smells like feces in the beginning. Yep, and... Anybody likes this fragrance? Has anyone ever tried this fragrance? Put it in the comments and tell me what you think about this fragrance. It's made by Lalique. It's called Ancre Noir à l'Extreme. I think that might be a good fragrance you could... Did you know when you shake a fragrance up and you see the bubbles slowly going like that, that means it has thicker oil content it could possibly mean how the bubbles move up slowly how they how long it lasts dallas texas in the house shot off blend what is that carlos tell me what shot off blend is what is this shot off blend shot off blend what is that mm, i like this not bad I'm going to give this away to Carlos Tamos if he buys that YSL myself. You want it, Carlos? Get it. I'll give you this bottle in your box right here. Because you've been supporting me all year long, commenting, watching, texting. It's real nice of you. Anakid is latent privé and dusk. Anakid is latent privé and dusk is just latent. So they're both by... The Woods Collection, Anakid and Dusk. Is that correct, LV Nate? I sold my Ancre Noir as fast as possible. I couldn't handle the church incense. I know, but this one is called Ancre Noir. I like stream. It's different, sweeter. I don't like it either. <laughs> we have the same taste. <clears throat> it's a new Angel Shear clone. Oh, oh, Shaf. Oh, what? Is that by Zimaya? No, is it? Texas sense. Denton, Texas. Where is Denton? I was just near Dallas. I was in Houston. I was in Port Aransas and Corpus Christi. Yes, the best one they have, Noir. That's the best one they have, Noir. Hmm. Okay, anything else we have down here? Oh yeah, this is really, really good. If you like Tribeca by Bond number 9, but I haven't found it yet. I just got it on Amazon. It's 40, 40. This smells good. I haven't tested the longevity yet either. Yeah, this one smells really, really good too. If you like Prada Luna Rosa Ocean, it's an amazing fragrance. 
Ventana Marine. It's one of those easy to wear, make you feel good fragrances. So that's it. If anybody is taking these, they're a dollar a piece plus shipping. And this is a dollar a piece plus shipping and the live 10 discount. And we talked about lots of fragrances today. And I tried to get to meet people and where they're from. Rob Thomas is from Kansas. I know I always ask you that. We got Carlos Tamos. We got Timur Sao. Did you talk about Celestial? No. I don't know what that is. Oh. I saw a review, if that's that aquamarine green color, celestial, they said it smelled like hospital floor cleaner, but the packaging was nice, that's what they said about it, so I hope, I think that's what you're talking about. Jamie Rivera from Chile. Tom Ford Noir Costa Azura. Yeah, there's some, but I can't think of them right now. There's one for Noir that's really good. Costa Azura. I can't think of it. There was a Zemaya. Yep. Zemaya Sharaf. I've tested the Zemaya brand before, and to be honest, it's kind of iffy. Um, kind of. I don't know, or something that was off about it. I think that's the Afnon company, but they had like Samaya, black, white, like the, the greatness oud, the goodness ouds, all those type of initial ouds they came out with a couple years ago. Hospital floor cleaner is hilarious. Yeah, that's what it says in the title. Mike Jones says, Merry Christmas. Where's Ankara Indigo released? When is Ankara Indigo? What is was that a new Lalique fragrance? Joachim Luftberg. Very cool. You look like a professor, sir. Or, or a chemical. Maybe you're a perfumer, huh? Very nice to meet you, sir. So thank you very much. I hope everyone has a fan fantastic holiday. And we'll see you on the next time. I'm going to take a break the next couple of days. But check out the emails. They're coming. There's also a 50% discount if you watch all the way to this point. Look in the description.